Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time coming across my channel, please just do me a favor and hit the subscription button so that you will not miss our news on royal updates. Thank you. Today, Queen Camilla ventured into the vibrant world of traditional crafts and contemporary artistry during her visit to a pop-up store in West London. The royal engagement featured a special highlight, a captivating painting of her step-granddaughter, Princess Charlotte. Her Majesty, who was enchanted by the fantastic Kindred Studios Shepherd's Bush pop-up hub, revealed that her daughter, Laura Lopes, had recommended the visit. Exploring the innovative workspaces, which were previously utilized by a homeless charity for accommodation, the Queen engaged with a diverse array of painters. During her interaction with the artists, Queen Camilla shared insights about her daughter's endorsement of the studio, stating, It was Laura who told me about this. She said it was so fantastic. You've got to have a look. However, it was a particular painting that stole the Queen's attention, a rendition of Princess Charlotte based on a photograph released to commemorate Charlotte's second birthday in 2017. Crafted by artist Mercedes Carbonell, the artwork drew admiration from Queen Camilla, who remarked, The Queen liked it very much. I think Charlotte looks like Queen Elizabeth in the photograph. Describing the painting as lovely, Camilla expressed her appreciation for Carbonell's talent and interpretation. Among the eclectic displays in the entrance hall were imaginative pieces by Cordelia Plunkett, mother of Camilla's equerry, Major Ollie Plunkett, who serves in the rifles. Plunkett's distinctive artworks, incorporating taxidermy to recreate iconic scenes, left a lasting impression on the Queen. Notably, she admired a whimsical rendition of the Beatles' Abbey Road album cover, featuring bird-headed figures in lieu of the iconic band members. Further exploration led Queen Camilla to encounter a replication of Tracy Emin's renowned artwork, My Bed. The recreation, complete with a bird nestled under a miniature duvet, resonated with Her Majesty's appreciation for contemporary artistry. Additionally, the Queen commended conservator Piran Hart for his meticulous craftsmanship, particularly his restoration of a late 19th-century Burmese wooden throne now exhibited at the British Museum. Impressed by Hart's dedication, Queen Camilla remarked, That must have been a labour of love. Meanwhile, King Charles returned to Sandringham following a brief stay at Clarence House in London. Speculations suggest that his visit to the capital was linked to ongoing cancer treatment following his recent diagnosis. As Queen Camilla continues her engagements in London, she is scheduled to host a reception commemorating the 100th anniversary of the Poppy Factory on Thursday, underscoring her commitment to various charitable endeavors. Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have a wonderful day.